this is Stefan Red or the Viewman09 or actually no, the Stefan Red or the Viewman09. And I'm going to do a review of Halloween re the remake Michael Miles 7 inch scale figure. Okay, so let's get started. Alright, so let's get started on the figure. The figure is. Wait. The figure is outstanding. He detailed, as you can see. Sorry, I'm kind of shaky with my hand today. Well, he looks really nice. Hmm. Alright, anyways, let's get with the detail. The detail, I really like the mask detail the best. Because all the cracks and the weathered looking of it. Um, I not, I'm not a big fan of the bloody side of his he head. But I like the unbloodified head. Side of the head. And if you look close there, I'm not sure if the camera can catch this, but you can see his eyes. Just like those black circles around him, and then he has eyes. <clears throat> Alright. Alright, let's get to the hand detail. Well, no, uh, short detail, jumpsuit detail. And the jumpsuit has amazingly good detail. It looks like it was actually came out of the movie. Well, I haven't seen the movie, but I've seen the clips of it. Second, everyone says the second movie's terrible and all that crap. Ooh, also in the detail I missed, the beard is actually showing through his mask. Like the hobo version. Something like that. Yeah, um, it has great detail in his uh, jumpsuit. Um, and also, and you can see all the blood on his jumpsuit. Kind of like a lime green or something. His hands all amazing detail. Um, even his knife has good detail. Looks all, not just the camera catches, but it looks kind of dirty and then there's like a whole black of blood. Right there. I think it's an amazing figure, and one amazing dude. Um, I did see the first remake, and it wasn't as good. Anyways, the shoes are pretty good. <clears throat> the remake was actually, um, really good. It was a nice remake. Um, full remake, it was pretty good. I just didn't like the beginning when they showed the flashbacks. There was so many killing, and all that crap and glow stuff. Anyways... I don't have a camera stand, so I'm using like a duct tape dismantle with a code, like with a training card on top, so it's really cheap. And, uh, let's get to the articulation. He has a uh, articulation in the wrist that can go back and forth, back and forth. Also in the other wrist. Um, it has, um, it doesn't have articulation. It actually does have articulation in the waist. Some right here. And not, and it also has a well, actually, a very, very little articulation in the feet. This, I'm not, not sure if it's a mess up, but this one doesn't have articulation in mine, but this one, like, has a centimeter. Wait, I'll just conclude that it has no articulation. There's a ball joint head. Um, you can, the arms can move out all the way around. Same with the other arm. Um, it has elbow movement. Sorry if you hear some sound, because that's my dad. Um, here's some elbow movement. Pretty nice. Pretty nice. It's basically all the articulation. Anyways, if you're wondering why I took the box and kept it, because I keep the packages of them just in case I want to put them back in. Like that other one I had. And... I don't know why, and alright, so let's just get to the package for some reason. The package is pretty nice, um, if you lift this up, well, first let's get to this. He has a little code right there that, I like it that it's not just straight and it's more like, you know, more crappy, like crappy, you know what I mean, like broken wood or something, I don't know. Um, you can see there's a, sorry if it's kind of bright. But I just told to see it. You could see that there's a Michael Miles photo back there. Except that little ball light. Screw that. Anyways, um, the Halloween Rob Zombie film, t Halloween 2. Um, there's a 7 inch Michael Miles figure. 
I'm not gonna read that out because that just we're doing we even read that. One second. Yo, I want to buy Mezco. Whoa. Oh my god, this is by Mezco? Oh, I thought it was by NECA. I can't believe I never knew that. I can't believe that. Oh, right there. Oh my, oh my god. It was for you just 18 and up, like I said in my last review. Don't follow through that. You just have to be mature. And old enough to see the movies. <clears throat> anyway, so. I'll just put them in a cool pose. Just wait. Let me get the camera, stupid camera, um, let me get him a cool pose, um, I actually like that pose from the remake and the original, when he was, like, toning his head, sort of, like that, also, I noticed that you can only tone the head on one side, actually, um, by the way, it's a great, amazing looking figure, see, it's amazing, um, I also want to show you, actually, um, I just want to shout out that, I already shouted out, and I'm already done with my shout out, but I'm actually, I actually, um, got a figure, and I'm getting that figure, the, even though I got the, the NECA version, like, I got the NECA, one second. Sorry about that, that was just a rude interruption from my dad. Like, I don't know why he keeps walking down the hill. Oh my god, that, like that neck of ocean, I know. But I'm getting a Mezco, I think it will be pretty nice. And, actually this is my collection, I'm not sure if I did a review on it. I'm gonna review this big baby, he's my center of my collection. I don't know why, but I just love that figure, and I got all this. Alright, so, this is Stefan Red. Um, I will, actually, I want to be called uh, Viewman09. That's what I want to be called, because that's my nickname on my YouTube channel, of course, you can look. Press Stefan Red below, in the blue, and you can, you can see all my channel videos. I'll be uploading more, so, that's what I want to say. Bye, and have a good time. Have a good time. Wait. Before that. Dang it, that. This is, this is my one. Uh, one second. Again. Dang it, no music. Never mind. I was going to put that down. Don't put that down. The Halloween. Same screen. Anyway, so... Bye.